What's going on guys? My name is Lauren Harriman. Um, I am a power lifter in the 57 kilo class. Um, today's the first day I'm getting ready for spring open. That was supposed to be in April, uh, but that got postponed due to the whole coronavirus uh, situation that's going on right now. So today marks the first day of this training cycle, uh, getting back into it. Uh, limited kind of gym access. I do work at a kickboxing facility called Legacy MMA and uh, was able to snag a barbell. So we are open due to, uh, my boss said something about essential license that he has. I'm not sure um, much detail on that, but I am able to go to one of our facilities in Buford. We have three, uh, Sugar Hill, Buford, and Brazelton. So I'm able to come in here after all the kids leave and workers and stuff and just kind of get a workout in. Today is deadlift day, so my favorite day. Uh, hopefully it'll be a good one. I kind of got excited yesterday. Um, I was able to get the barbell, so I wanted to do some movements, deadlift being one of them. So hopefully I can stick to the program as much as possible and pull as much weight as I can. Uh, so yeah, stay tuned. All right, guys, so I'm just gonna add some commentary to this video. Uh, what you'll be seeing are my working sets for my competition deadlift. Uh, so we are running on an RPE system. So if you don't know what that is, that is rate of perceived exertion. Uh, so whatever I'm feeling that day, uh, is usually kind of what I lift and stick to. So this week was an eight. So I should be able to get the reps pretty easy and then have like two, two more reps in the tank. Uh, so we we're doing three sets of five. I was able to pull 255 pounds, which was good. Um, so yeah, you'll just see all three. I had three sets of these. Uh, they felt pretty good, but like I said before in the earlier video, I did some deadlifts the previous day, so wasn't able to lift as much as I thought I could, uh, but that's still okay. We'll, we have another deadlift session this week um, that I'll show you guys. But yeah, so uh, here's the rest of the uh, sets and reps and enjoy. All right, next movement we had were pause deadlifts. If you have not done these or added these in your program, I highly, highly suggest that you add these. Uh, they are very humbling. Um, so what you're supposed to do is add or pause uh, the bar uh, against your mid shin. And for my specific program, I had to hold it for two seconds. Um, so usually I like to count out loud just because that kind of helps me make sure that it's actually two seconds. Um, but yeah, these, uh, definitely will add some overall progress to your deadlift weight that you can lift. And I highly, highly recommend that you guys add these and or banded deadlifts. Uh, so yeah, I had three sets of five again with these at a RPE eight. So you'll be able to see the rest of my, uh, sets on here.
right, guys, so it's about 8 o'clock. Uh, I just finished deadlift session. Um, so just locking the place up. That's Legacy MMA, Buford location. Um, so yeah, she's gonna go home, relax, fill out some client uh, workouts for them, uh, update them on all their workouts and everything, and get some food. Not too hungry at the moment, but I'm sure I will be in a little bit once I come down from that workout. Uh, so yeah, uh, tomorrow I'm gonna be at a home gym. My coach actually, one of his friends from the Muscle City Barbell is letting me come over and work out in his garage. So tomorrow's chest day. Um, so I'll check up back with you guys then. Have a good night. What's going on guys? Today is Tuesday, March 31st, uh, day two. Getting ready for spring open. Uh, that's actually, it's moved to July 11th. It was April 6th, but due to coronavirus and everything, uh, they had to kind of postpone it a little bit. So we are gonna go to a friend's home gym. Thankfully, he is allowing uh, some people to come and work out there, which is super nice, appreciate it, and it's chest day. So we got about 25, 30 minute drive ahead of us, um, and then I'll record some stuff while I'm working out. <laughs> what's going on guys uh so as you can see from my warm up uh, i was feeling pretty good on this chest day i had just come off of a deload week so i was feeling pretty fresh pretty rest up so i was aiming for uh 155 for my comp bench today three sets of five rp8 it's kind of the trend for this week um so as i was <laughs> going along i kind of I guess bit off a little bit more than I could chew. Everything was fine until the fourth and fifth rep. Uh, as you can kind of see here coming up, it turns out to be kind of like an RPE 9, 9.5. It was kind of a struggle. So good thing Treshawn was looking out and had me uh, in a spot. Um, but shout out to Dan uh, for letting me train out of his home gym. Um, really appreciate it. And I will be there uh, this Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Uh, so yeah, I ended up docking down the weight as you can see here i went to 145 pounds that was uh for sure an rp8 um so you'll see the rest of my sets and reps on here so yeah definitely uh <laughs> had to take a little gut check and drop it down to 145 but still overall pretty good and i was happy with this session Two, three. 
All right, guys. So the next movement that I had in my program were chains or banded bench. Uh, there weren't any chains at this particular uh, gym, so we went with banded. I'm telling you, bands will add so much more to more weight to your lifts. Uh, so here I could only get 115, but that band adds like constant tension throughout the movement. So again, if you haven't incorporated them into your program. I'm telling you, do it, and it, it'll amaze you. Um, but yeah, so I got 115 here. Again, 3x5, RP8. Uh, felt pretty good. Um, but yeah, so here's the rest of my reps and sets. All right, so after those main lifts and variations, uh, I moved into my assistance work. So all of these are gonna be five sets of five, uh, still RPE eight. Uh, so what you'll see here, barbell row from the floor, got 115 pounds. Uh, next would be a flat dumbbell bench, uh, 45 pounds. I usually can do about like 60 pounds, but 45 was the highest that, um, that they had at this uh, garage gym. So I just, kept doing reps until it felt like an RP8. Uh, and so for this, I think it was around like 10 reps or so when it started to feel like an eight. Uh, and then I moved into a standing single arm dumbbell shoulder press, uh, 30 pounds with that. And then finally I did, I get, so in my program, it's usually like written out as tricep of choice. I really, really like overhead tricep extension. You can either do this sitting or standing. I chose to uh, do it sitting this particular day and I got 45 pounds. So at the end of this workout, I was pretty uh, done. <laughs> As you can see, I was pretty tired. So yeah, enjoy the rest of the, rest of the video. All right, so this is going to conclude episode one of Road to Spring Open. I look forward to sharing more videos with you guys of my training. Also, if you need a personal trainer, just shoot me an email at lherriman6 at gmail.com. I'll be happy to help. See you guys soon.